guys, welcome back to the shop. So today, in this episode, I want to deal with the back of the water blank. Now I have the top thickness to level. So now I can determine the overall height of the body blank, which I'm aiming for a 4 to 4 mil, roughly one and three quarters of an inch. So in order to do that, <coughs> sorry, I need to remove a couple of mil from the back. Since I don't have a drum sander or a thickness planer to this size, what I do, I usually put it in the CNC and mill uh, face down the material. So that's what I will do today. And then when the back is dimensioned, I can cut the recess, oops, sorry, the recess for the neck pocket, for the neck heel, and the holes for the neck bolts with the neck ferrules, because I go with machine screws rather than wood screws. It it makes looks much more nicer and sophisticated rather than using wood screws with the big plate. That's what I go for. That's the look that I go for. Anyways, so back to the machine. Okay guys, so let's have a look at the tool pets for today's episode. So what I like to start is to clear out this material for the neck heel. And here I'm using a 15mm router bit. Next up is to smooth out the snack heel by using a quarter inch ball and end mill. Then I want to move on to the string ferrules using a quarter inch end mill. And with the same end mill, I want to do the neck um, mounting screws ferrules. and finishing up a drilling operation for the neck bolts but I'm just going to spot drill this hose
Oh, and I almost forgot again to do the top string ferrules, which I'm just going to spot drill with a 1.8 uh, spot drill. So the body blank is finished from machining, everything went well, the back is, came really nice, especially here, the neck heel. I will finish drilling drilling through the, the holes on the drill press, I prefer that way, to spot them and then continue finish up on the drill press. Now it's to the appropriate thickness. The top ferrules came really good as well. And the next up for this body will be sanding. A lot of sanding and then prepare for stain. The next step for the next episode will be dealing with the neck. Now guys bear with me because I still have to construct the neck blanks and then we'll prepare the neck for CNC machining. So guys until then I thank you very much I hope you liked it and enjoyed it and I hope you learned something from it like subscribe and share with your friends and I'll see you next time take care bye bye